Hello everybody and welcome to my 1 to 99 fishing guide. Items we're gonna need is fly fishing rod, a lot of feathers, small fishing net, harpoon and lobster pod. Those items can all be bought from Gerant right here in Port Serim. As you can see you can buy a small fishing net here, you don't need fishing rod, you need fly fishing rod, harpoon and lobster pod. And you can also buy a lot of feathers here which is really nice. So in case you don't know, this guy is located right here in Port Serim, pretty close to Drainer Village as well. So it's really not hard to buy items from him. But if you want to buy it for a little bit more money, just buy it from Grand Exchange. So in my previous guide I got asked to also implement the quests that give uh, fishing experience. So here they are. But uh, I seriously recommend to finish Sea Slug quest at level 1 si since it will boost you from level 1 to 24 and you skip all the shrimp anchovy part. And then also later on you're gonna need the Swan Song quest done uh, which also requires 62 fishing and we will include this area uh, in our guide for monk fishing. So um, yeah, I suggest you to do at least Sea Slug and Swan Song. Well, if you can't do Swan Song, there are other options, but Sea Slug is quite of a must since it will boost you from level one to twenty-four, as I said earlier. So if for some reason you decided not to do Sea Slug quest, you will have to start your fishing adventure right here in Drainer Village. As you can see, the fishing spot is really close to the bank. So you just wanna right, you just wanna click on a fishing spot and click net. From level one, it's gonna be really slow, but um, from level one to fifteen, you're going to catch a lot of shrimps, and they give ten experience each, and it's gonna take a really long time. But then from level fifteen to twenty, you're gonna catch anchovies here, uh, combined with shrimps. So you will have to stay here from level 1 to 20 and it will take you quite some time so just be patient or simply do sea slug quest. Ok so once you're level 20 you have two options, you have option of going for the fastest fishing experience right there and this is just doing 1 to 24 sea slug then from 24 to 58 fly fishing and from 58 to 99 barbarian fishing. I will first show this technique and after that there will be a money um, uh, fishing guide so uh, let's just uh, show the path to the best location to fly fish right here. Uh, we're gonna start in Ardun and uh, work our way uh, to the docks right here. And of course it's worth to mentioning that for doing this method you will have to have the Shiloh village quest completed. So uh, if you can do that simply um, fly fish uh, right here. Let me quickly find it on a minimap. So if you can't go to Shiloh village you will fish right here south of Edgedeville right next to Barbarian Village and you're gonna be here from level 24 to 58 or from 24 to 55 depends on the which method you use and we're gonna talk to about that a bit later so right now let me quickly show you the way to the Shiloh Village in case you have the quest done you're quickly gonna pay fare to the Captain Barnaby and he's going to take you right here to the Brimhaven you go off the ship, you run south and then you find the guy that uh, offers you to uh, take you to Shilo village for 200 GP and you say yes of course and once you are here you have bank really close and the fishing spot is right near the bank as well so you just want to lure the fishing spot and you're gonna be catching trouts from level 20 to 30 and then you're gonna catch trouts and salmon from 30 up to 58 or 54 as you decide. So once you have the full inventory you're gonna want to run south a bit and just bank your items right here in the local shop, I mean local bank, whatever. You're just gonna bank them and continue to fish. So since we are doing the fastest method first you're gonna want to do from level 58 to 99 barbarian fishing and in order to do so you want to teleport with games necklace to the barbarian outpost and then you wanna round south. 
So in a minimap, as you can see, Barbarian Assault, we're gonna fish right around here near Otan's Grotto. And in order to be able to fish here, you're going to need 45 strength and 45 agility, as well as have completed the minigame to do so. I will not show how to complete the minigame, so you'll have to search that by yourself, but it's really simple. So as soon as you complete the mini quest, you will get Barbarian's Rod and you can start your fishing adventure to level 99 right here. You use your rod on the fishing spot and you're gonna get a lot of fishes which give a lot of experience as well. And you from level 58 to 99 you're going to get also 1.5 million agility experience and 1.5 million strength experience. So this is gonna be quite a lot uh, by the long run and as you can see it's really fast as well. So the experience you're going to get here will be between 55 and 60k uh, experience per hour and I'm sorry there is no footage on this part. So the problem occurs when you have the full inventory of raw fish. Since there is no bank near, you can either drop them manually like that or in case you're using OS body you can also drop them using mouse keys and this looks like that. And as you can see, this is pretty faster than doing it manually, so um, you can search for a separate guide for that, and if you're still having problem using mouse keys, I will gladly make a guide on how to use them, and just let me know in the comments if you still have problems with using the mouse keys. So you're gonna want to do this from level 58 to 99, as I said, and it's gonna take you a long, long time. So this completes the fastest method of of uh, fishing. So now we're gonna go to the money making method. So for the money making method you're gonna want to complete the sea slug quest from level 1 to 24 same as the fasted method. Then you're gonna do fly fishing from 24 to 55 and after that you're gonna want to come to Catherby right here the fishing village and you can also buy some supplies from this guy right here so let's quickly check what he offers to sell. You can buy pretty much same as uh, same things as from the guy in Port Serene. Small fishing net, lobster pot and harpoon. Right here we're just gonna need a harpoon and a lobster pot. So from level 55 to 62 you're gonna want to right click to the option to the fishing spot and click, well you need to find it and click cage. So like that you're gonna catch some lobsters and um, lobsters will provide a decent experience which is well it's not that decent because it's only 15k experience per hour but it's gonna give you a lot of money and whatnot so um, yeah money wise lobsters are definitely worth it and at 62 you will want to go to monkfishes but if you can't do that, just continue doing lobsters until you can eventually do sharks for even more money. So right now I'm gonna show you where to fish monkfish. So in order to fish monkfish, you're going to have to complete the swang song quest and it requires 100 quest points to do so. And it's pretty hard to get that many quest points, so if you can't come to this place, you should stay with lobsters. But I seriously suggest you to be able to come to this place since I would advise you to stay here to the level 99 since it is nice 30k experience f per hour and it is very AFK and it also gives you a lot of money. As you can see each monkfish is 400 GP and you're gonna catch, catch a lot of monkfish here and it's gonna give you a lot of money. So um, uh, we are located in the Piscatories fishing colony. You can come here by typing this code into the fairy ring or just running long long way from the three gnome stronghold right over here and then north 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 even more north until you come to the to the fishing colony so um, I suggest you to stay here until level 99 but uh, if you are more um, hungry for money you can also do sharks even though I think this is even faster money than sharks I'm still gonna show the shark method um, just for the sake of the video really so um, in order to go there the quickest way is just to uh, teleport to Ardun and run north so I'm gonna quickly pause the video here and show you the way after so once you come to Ardun center you want to run north from here until you reach the fishing guild 
The requirement to enter the fishing guild is level 68 fishing, I think. So, um, yeah, if you... Uh, if you... If you don't have uh, that amount of fishing yet, you can also use fishing potions uh, to boost your fishing up a little bit and whatnot. So, um, well, yeah, this method right here is advised from level 80 forward or else it will be way too slow. But um, from 80 to 99, you're gonna get 15k experience here, which is really slow. But you, you will gain money, so let's wait until we catch one shark right there for 110 experience you're gonna catch a shark and each shark is only seven uh, actually only 600 GP worth so definitely this method is not worth to do monkfishes are way way better you catch them way way faster and they give more experience so do not do sharks unless you are I don't know Iron Man and you need decent food but uh, other than that, stick with monkfishes until level 99. They give you nice 30k experience per hour if you FK. You can get up to 35, maybe even close to 40k experience per hour if you're uh, pretty close to the 99 already. So um, yeah, I think this will complete my guide. Uh, it was a little bit sloppy since uh, I didn't have it that good planned. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, make sure to like the video, also comment, point out my mistakes so I can improve on my next video. And I'm out, bye.